Question 19. The circuits contain a number of identical cells and a number of identical resistors. In which circuit is the current of the cells the highest? So in order to have highest current, we need to have lowest resistance. So looking through the circuit, the quickest way is to look for the circuit that has only parallel arrangement because parallel circuits will always give us a total resistance that's less than any other configuration. However, if you want to prove this further, you can actually take it that each resistor has a value of R and go and find manually every single total resistance. A will give us a total resistance of R. B will give us a total resistance of R plus two R's in parallel, which will be this. And this gives us three over two R. C will give us two resistors in parallel, which will give us R over 2 total, D would be simply 2R. So looking at the four options, we can see clearly that C has the lowest possible total resistance and therefore the current will be the highest.